Hello. So tonight we're coming to you from the backyard. Kelly and I did a bunch of work here in Pennsylvania today in our backyard because it's really nice out. So one thing I want to mention is I want to thank everybody. We have now surpassed 100 subscribers, so we're very excited about that. So tonight we're just going to do some smash burgers on the Blackstone griddle. So what I have is I, I defrosted some of this Kobe ground beef. It's at ShopRite. And basically, it's just Wagyu beef from Australia. We got some bacon, and we got our burgers, quarter pound each. Cheese, two slices per burger. Brioche buns, and then we just have the usual, um, the usual oil and butter that I'll be cooking with as we go through. So, first thing I'm going to do is we're going to get this bacon on. And excuse the black paint. I uh, actually spray painted some things today and I just can't get the paint off. So for this black uh, Blackstone grill, it is like one of my favorite appliances I have because clearly, as you can imagine, we like to do cheesesteaks. So when we have a crowd of people, you could get a whole bunch of steak meat on this thing. And again, we're not, we're not uh, since we're just setting up outside, I'm not fully leveled up and have things where they normally, where they normally sit, but we're taking advantage of the nice weather. I uh, love the sizzle of that bacon. And the smell. Gonna put a little bit of olive oil on the grill. And for those of you that have been watching the videos, you know I have to have my butter. So we'll just get this around here. And we'll put our burgers down. You want to leave some room. So when you smash them down, they don't get in the way of anything. And I forget I didn't take these out of the um, of the freezer, so I had to defrost them. So got a little bit of microwave stuff going on. So what we're going to do is we're just going to take our smasher and we're going to start having at it here. Take the salt and pepper and get them on these burgers. <laughs> this poor burger is really hurting there, huh? So the one nice thing about this is that these will get done very quickly. So we're going to pull our bacon off. And then just to get that extra nice flavor in there, we're going to take these smash burgers and we're going to flip them right into the bacon fat. That's flavor. Flavor 101. And then <laughs> this is just kind of like a casserole burger, I guess, huh? This is, this is going to be my double cheeseburger right here. 
And then what we're going to do is we're going to butter these buns up and we're going to put them on as well. All right, now we're just going to get the cheese on here. And everybody builds their burgers differently. Some people like to put on the bacon and then the cheese so it holds it all together. Oh yeah, burgers, buns are getting nice and crisped up. Just the way we like them. And I love this because you could really get all that cheese and that gooeyness that comes down off there. How's that looking, Cal? Looking good. So, this is going to be my burger. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to take that and I'm going to just slide that right on. And then I'm going to take some of the bacon or all of the bacon since my girls told me that when they were little, I never shared my bacon with them. And then I'm gonna put another one right on top of there. So it looks like we're gonna have an extra bun, but the casualties of war. And Kelly, you see how that cheese just starts to get nice and gooey there. Okay, I'm just going to do a rough scrape on our griddle. And then I'll come out and clean it in a little bit just with some water and some oil to season it. All right, so we are just ready to dig in. I like a raw onion on my burger and ketchup and mayo. And then we have all those extra bacon in there. And I made myself a double cheeseburger for those of you who caught it. So take a look at that thing. Oh, Ooh, looks delicious. Look at that. Mmm. I love the crunchy bits around there. It's so good. Super good. All right. Thank you, everybody. And please, please subscribe. Click, below, click below to subscribe. So we can keep bringing all these cool videos. Hopefully they're cool. Maybe they're not cool. Do you think they're cool? I think they're cool. Are you cool? Yes. Delicious. Okay. Thanks, and thanks for uh, getting us 100 subscribers, everyone.